What's up, Parminiacs? Pyro Stasis here. We are back in the world of FTB Unleashed. And today we're going to be taking a look at Curtis's competition entry. Snicker. Snicker. Even I... I'm terrible at spelling, but even I've got to be like, that's not right there. Of course, all the, the poor illiterate spelling people are like, I don't understand what he's saying. It looks fine to me. There's nothing wrong. What, what are you talking about, Pyro? All right, so let's go ahead and hop in here. Enough, enough poking fun at the poor bastard spelling. Let's see how he does with his base. All right, so we have spawned in here. I have a book on me. Um, I guess that's Tinker's book. There's some piggies down there. I'm afraid. Wait a minute. What is this? Ooh. Oh, it's pixel art. It's a nice little sword. I like that. Plus, plus five kudos points for pixel art. I like that. All right, so we're gonna do a quick 360 around the outside of the base. Um, and right off the bat, I'm noticing we've got a we've got a problem with the house. Um, all right, first off, the guys in the stream are asking for an OCD check, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, ooh, oh, one, two, three. We got four. We got a whole shit ton. But I mean, then again, you can't really bitch about this one because it's, you know, it's 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 side by side. You know, I mean, it's it's not it's not two separate buildings. But I I do kind of have to bitch about the fact that there's no way into the place unless I'm missing it. I mean, unless you've got some like super secret entrance. Um, I I don't I don't see any way in. So I'm gonna come over here and punch my way in. We're gonna see if there's anything down here on the bottom floor. Um It looks like this was a pixel art for something large. There's a heart here, and then there's two swords. Um There's a face there. And um, some more stuff over here. So interesting. Well, um, this place is not the, the the top floor is not big enough, obviously, to to do any of the boilers with. Let's see. Uh, this floor is not either because it's only four high. And the middle floor. Let's see if the middle floor can do it one two three there's only three blocks in the middle floor so i'm thinking unfortunately that this one even for my for my most lenient niceness uh is is probably missing out on uh on on the whole the whole point of the, the project so we can't put a boiler in here at all um, we could put a really small one we could put several really small ones um, but unfortunately, we can't get uh, any of the decent-sized boilers in here. Uh, the other thing is, uh, I'm not sure if we want a wood house for um, for a, a, a base that's going to be uh, handling steam. It it just doesn't seem like it, it just doesn't seem like it's the uh, the most intelligent use of of, of building materials because I, I have a feeling that with um with with hot things that the wood might possibly burn so i'm i'm just i'm just saying it might be a problem you know i'm not judging too badly other than you know what i i would normally judge i'm just saying that you know if there were if there was a minor heat issue at some point in time during the uh during the usage of said steam engines that burn at a thousand degrees centigrade that it might it might cause some problems so i'm gonna have to kind of personally give curtis kind of a thumbs down unfortunately because uh we we can't put our stuff in and there was no entrance and there was no access points on the uh on the floors but i do have to give it a thumbs up for looking really really pretty as it burns but then again, that's kind of a dick thing. So let me know what you guys thought about it. Did you guys like it? Did you guys not like it? Am I being too picky? Should I just use a million little small boilers in it? 
Uh, is it something that could be fixed with a little bit of changes? Let me know in the comments section below. As always, if you are liking this series, make sure you slap that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next club.